Hi Erin. Today is Wednesday, August 3rd, and if I look a little blurry tonight, it's because there's not very good lighting because it's 10.30 at night because I spent most of the day putting together a puzzle for the second day in a row and am only now remembering that I have to post a vlog tonight. Except with personalities and puzzles, they're a little dangerous. So, fortunately, I had something that I had been planning to vlog about because a couple weeks ago you vlogged about time travel and asked me what people I would want to meet if I had a time machine. Um, and first of all, I really liked your answers. They were very good. So, in thinking about this question, um, I didn't really come up with any specific people I would want to meet. Uh, if I had a time machine, there are time periods I would want to go to, like I would really love to go to medieval British Isles and ancient Greece and ancient Egypt um, and places like that. Well, those places specifically. Uh, Regency England, that would be exciting. Um, but not like specific people. I would just want to go to those time periods more for like learning the language and going to parties. Like, it would be really exciting to go to ancient Greece and learn ancient Greek. And then I could go to regions in England and go to fun parties where people do fancy dances and have um, awkward small talk, and it would be exciting. And then I could go to the medieval British Isles and, well, actually, maybe disguise myself as a boy and go to the medieval British Isles. And, and fight with swords. Anyway, I, I didn't really think of any specific people, but those are some of the time periods I want to go to. Um, and I hope that kind of answers your question, I guess. There are also um, like more recent things that I would want to go to. I would want to go back to 1991-ish, and you just I am me. Hold on, I'm going to mute and minimize you. Okay. Um, so I'd want to go back to like, not, I think it was probably like 91-ish, anyway, go to a lot where they were filming movies and just like hang out there, um, and do things like that, like go to the filming of Lord of the Rings, fun things like that, and I, I wrote some more stuff. Also, so I was having a conversation with Kate the other day, I don't remember if we were talking about Disney or if we were talking about time travel, um, at any rate, she was talking about how if she could time travel, one of the things she wanted to do, and she may have stolen this idea from one of her other friends, whatever, it doesn't matter, the idea is awesome regardless of who it was, um, to go to like all the big momentous events at all the Disney parks, like when each park opened or when they had like giant anniversary or birthday things, um, like to go to all of those. That would be amazing, like totally amazing. I guess we're assuming that the time machine can also travel in space, which means I would probably use it for like really recent or near future events, like going to K-pop concerts. I think I would pretty much stick to the past, partly because I really like learning about the past. I really like culture and language, hence degrees in anthropology and linguistics and library science. So that makes sense. Um, and I, I mean, I'm interested in the future, but I don't really want to see what it's like. Like, I would like to experience things about the past, but I don't, I don't really want to travel into the future and see things. Maybe like way off in the future. Also, I mean, like, if the doctor came and picked me up in the TARDIS, I'd go wherever. That, <laughs> where the TARDIS wants to go, not where the doctor wants to go, it's where the TARDIS wants to go. Erin, I will see you on Monday. Monday is your day. I'll see you then.